Common Sense of a Duke's Daughter, Chapter 158 Secret Meeting It was quite possible to fill it up, right? I mutter satisfied seeing the paper at hand. After finishing the conference and the normal operations of the territory were over, I stayed all the time with Dean. It is midnight. Even if I look at the scenery outside the window, there will probably be no house or shop with the lights on. Yeah. After that, we need to take care of the foundation and the commercial guilds that are the basis for each business and doctors. That's what it is, Dean. Needless to say they are going to be even more rooted to the people, to the people, will they? Yes. Now I'm conducting a flood control work in this area, but I could not fully explain its necessity. Though I'm through that matter, after all why is it necessary for all the people? I think that it would be better to explain firmly how to make that system work, and appoint them to explain to the people, though some people may not be convinced, but I think that less dissatisfaction will be than if they do not know anything, I see. It is a very good idea young lady, is not it? He smiled sweetly, and the cover of my heart opened for a moment. If I think about it, I'm alone with him since this morning. Well, before I used to be fine. What are you talking? I concentrate on the conversation with him to shake off that feeling. You are a lord, even as a substitute, even if you order it. What you say is the law. You really love us, people who live in this place, his expressions when he said so, I felt like there was a shadow for a moment. Dean. I'm sorry, I think that it would be better to let everyone know, it would be better to spread the news in some way, not verbally. By orally it's impossible to gather and tell everyone, because there is a school and there is a high literacy rate of this place. If it is a household with a child, because the child will be the person who lets his family know, it will depend on his understanding of the message as to how it distorts the meaning, I can foresee it definitely. Well, let's try to spread things to all families, instead of only by school, just like information magazines. Well, in the kingdom, only the upper class reads the information magazine. In this territory, it seems that you can have an information magazine for the common people, no matter what, someday you will achieve it. Because this territory is promoting education, well, I wonder how good it will be. I can say that it is good because the relation between the school and the people is good, most of the aristocrats are afraid of knowledge. In contrast to my joyful voice, his voice is of someone afraid talking with seriousness. Oh, why is that? Milady was told before, the knowledge is power, it seems to be right. The knowledge is a kind of privilege and is the existence of this country. The people with knowledge hold down the people without. Milady gave people knowledge, meaning that you mistress crashed part of the country's status system, well. Hoo hoo. To me who laughed, Dean looked at me as if asking what was my real intention. I did not answer at once, opened the window and went to the veranda. It is pitch dark, I cannot see anything. However, closing my eyes makes me think of the cityscape on the back of the eyelids. Certainly, it is fun to hold down those who do not know, because they do not know what I do, but if you suppress their opinions when one day you make a mistake. When one day Burn succeeds my father, if the descendants of Burn commit a big mistake, I would like the people to be free to express themselves and have a choice. In this place that they live, that's a right for them. I wonder if it's because of my knowledge of the previous life. I've been promoting what Dean said, with awareness. I guess it is heresy to put it in this world. The scariest thing is to not know my mistakes because the people move with wrong guesses and not knowledge. 
I think that I would be uneasy because I do not know if my people is dissatisfied and they would turn to violence to show the dissatisfaction instead of them themselves think and judge and express their thoughts, reflect their opinion, and then put the affairs in their place. This is the best idea. Looking back towards him, he looked surprised and opened his eyes. To that expression, I inadvertently smile up. In the first place it is impossible to restrain human inquiry completely, I think. Knowledge is a privilege. No. Because people are thinking creatures, it's a right to everyone. No matter what you do, it will come back to you when the people rise. As I said, he laughed. His voice resonated well the silent space. As it is rare for him to laugh with a loud voice, I am surprised this time. Certainly, indeed, people, will they rise, to my last question, are you speculating? No, somehow, I feel that way too, so it seems that the battle for the throne in the kingdom seems stupid. One hundred years ahead, the royal family disappears from people with a grudge. Whether it is up to the king in the future to be respected or not. The people will do the judgment if good or bad. Is it that I was too narrow? Dean, I think that it is an overstatement of something already known. Although I say so, Dean seems to be happy somehow. Something has blown out from him. I was. Oh, milady, please just continue. He <laughs> he, as an accomplice, take my remarks to heart, I feel sorry for him, I'm laughing at how naive his thoughts were. Yes, of course. If hey hey, then, what if I serve as an accomplice, is not it a keeper? In this case, I feel that I have to serve you well, but, come on, 